Here's the field for the uh, fourth race. Tonight's fourth, Phillies and Mares, five-year-olds and under. Racing a mile, a purse of $2,500. Number one is Ardente, owned by Lynn Brown of Marengo. Last week in drives. Two is Crew Angel. Owned by Mae Jean Allen and uh, Clara Chapman of Florida and New Jersey. Carl Allen drives. Number three, Follow My Mom, owned by Roger, Mary Jean, and Bruce Walls of Greenville for Eric Lunford. Four is Maggie Jane, owned by Ron Collier of New Carlisle with Dan Eater. Five is Sweet Samantha, owned by Fred, Marion Frarian, Jr. of Marion, Ohio, Brand Hanners Drives. Number six, Life's Dream, over the Brittany Farms of a Sales, Kentucky, Del Miller. Seven is Queen Ship, owned by J.D. Burnett of Wilmington for Chip Noble. Number eight, Gift, owned by Pacey Midland, Ken Goen, and Glenn Gross of Ohio and Pennsylvania. S Sam Coven, the driver, Coven. Nine is Linda Lunnell, owned by Charles Blankenship of Asheville, Mark Klott to the bike. Number 10, she's a farm girl, owned by Mark Perrin of Middletown, Dave Ram of Lebanon. Drivers change, Greg Grismore. Grismore. One place show, perfective, and pick three wagering. Nine minutes until post time, nine minutes. Fourth race pacing, Phillies and Mares lining up, moving in. On the backstretch, nearing the start. And uh, they're off, and it's Baggy Jean, uh, first to leave, and alongside, it's Crew Angel. From between horses, follow my mom. From the inside, fourth, Ardente. Slipping through five, she's a farm girl. Angling in, sixth comes, sweet Samantha. Along the wheel in seventh, it's Life's Dream. The inside, three lengths, eighth, Queenship, followed by Gift, and Linda Lanell trails. Right of the upper turn, reaching the first quarter mile marker, and Allen has Crew Angel. The two-year-old Abercrombie Philly leads the way here by two lengths. Opening panel in 28 and one. Maggie Jane, the garden spot trip at second. Follow my mom, follows third. Inside of fourth, Ardente. Five of the inside, she's a farm girl. First up of the outside, sixth. Here comes the other two-year-old Abercrombie Philly. It's life's dream as she gets underway. And Linda Lanell quickly moves after the live cover is racing sixth. She's a farm girl, now back seventh. Sweet Samantha, the inside of eighth. Gift on the outside, ninth. And now trailing in off stride is Queen Ship. They're uh, at the half, 58 and three. Off the turn and down the back stretch, and Crew Angel uh, moving along briskly here, but a snug hold on the two year old filly. Now by three lengths. Inside and chasing second is Maggie Jane. Follow my mom, gapping badly. Three lengths is third. Inside and fourth, Ardente. Outside, Life Stream uh, having a trouble keeping up with this pace. Is first up and going nowhere as they reach the three quarter mile marker in one, 26 and two. And Crew Angel still leading by three. Inside, Maggie Jane. She'll have to hurry now, catching the two-year-old filly. As they turn for home, they've lost it an eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch, it's all Crew Angel. She's putting this field away handily tonight. Crew Angel opens up by five, and now six. Maggie Jane is all by herself second. Follow my mom now battling for show, but it's all Crew Angel in record time. One, 54-1. Ladies and gentlemen, trackside, the official winner of the fourth race, Crew Angel at Abercrombie Philly from an oil burner mare, Peach Bottom, over May Jean Allen and Clara Chapman. Carl Allen trains and drives. Crew Angel coming in from Grand Circuit Racing at Hoosier Park. Only her fifth career start this evening. Her third career win, very impressively, it's a new track record, equaling the track record, rather, 154 and one fifth off a half and 58 and three. Very impressive tonight.
Here's how they finish in the fourth race. Sardente, five. Crew Angel, the winner. Follow My Mom, three. Maggie Jane, two. Sweet Samantha, 